Hey guys, welcome back to Dune Sport Custom Toy Haulers. Today we have a 14 foot DK model here to show you. Got a full walkthrough video of this and uh, can't wait to show it to you. It is an awesome trailer inside and out. So let's get to it. Outside we've got corrugated aluminum siding in our dark charcoal finish. This is like a gunmetal color. It's got an electric awning here off this passenger side. If you notice, it does have Furion cameras. It's got a three camera setup on this trailer. Um, so the side markers, and then it's got another one above in the rear. We've got a solar port here as well for your, your portable solar panels. Pass through storage. On the roof of this unit, we do have 800 watts of solar. So more than enough solar for such a small trailer here. Uh, this trailer does have two lithium batteries. So two 200 amp hour batteries here, 400 watt, uh, 400 amp hours total. You got your Rover solar controller here, 60 amp solar controller by Renogy. On this passenger side, we've got a, an exterior hot and cold spray port. So this is gonna get you a lot more pressure a lot nicer to rinse things off versus your exterior shower. So it does have hot and cold. Um, we do also provide a quick fitting here. So if you want a longer garden hose of some sort than this, that you can travel with under the trailer to your passenger side, that, uh, that's an option for you as well. So looking at this trailer here, it's got a standard six gallon water heater um, two 3,500 pound axles, so 7,000 pound gross vehicle weight rating. Got an exterior ladder that you can get to the roof to clean off your panels. Looking at this rear patio over here, we've got an awning. So this is a Gerard awning that's mounted above the seven foot tall ramp door. And then below here, we've got a rear patio kit with cables. So you can do just the cables if you want, um, or the fence. This fence is awesome for small children or pets, just to keep them from falling off or escaping. The trailer. So that's what that looks like there. Above this ramp door here, we've got your rear camera. So the third camera for that Furion setup. And then it looks like a couple of floodlights as well. This awning off the rear here does have an LED light strip. So just a light that's not just too bright. Those floodlights can be a little bit bright for some. So look at that, rear patio, awesome. Awesome place to hang out, set some chairs out, enjoy the weather. So there's your side awning. Let's go ahead and take you inside. A couple of exterior outlets here added. So one by the entry door comes standard. And then we added a second one here down at the rear. So we can put those outlets anywhere you want, inside or outside of the trailer. Um, and before we step inside, we've got a couple of exterior speakers here mounted as well. So keypad, wireless entry, or keyless entry anyway. So now inside of the trailer, this is our DK floor plan. So you've got the corner kitchen here. So up above, you've got some storage cabinets. We've got a convection microwave. So this is actually an oven and microwave. And then down below, we've got a two burner cooktop. with a glass top cover. In the corner here, we've got a window. Every window we have has blinds. You can op opt in for uh, day night shades if you want. We've got lights on these overhead cabinets. A corner sink. This is one with our pull down wand. So this size here is a, a 17 wide by 20, 22 inch deep down in the base you've got your dvd player 
battery and tank monitor. This one's outfitted with our heated tanks, keep tanks from freezing. Um, it's also outfitted with a 3000 watt inverter. So this trailer can technically be off grid and run the AC as long as you have sunlight. Down on this side here, we've got a, a water filtration system and then a smaller inverter here for our, our uh, TV. And then um, the water heater in the corner. So a lot packed into such a small trailer. Um, and you guys have seen these before. This is the rear deck view of the patio for our cameras. But you can see um, driver's side, uh, passenger side, and then the, um, the over the ramp door. So it, it can act as a security feature. It, it does detect motion. And this is sitting on a, a folding shelf. So we can put folding shelves wherever you want, outlets wherever you want. It does have a 13.5 thousand BTU AC. So plenty for this size trailer. This trailer is actually gonna head to Alaska. They're coming down from Alaska. They're picking up their transit van and they're gonna pick up this toy hauler and go camping. So in the rear here, I won't take the time to lower it all the way down, but you do have the queen bed above to sleep on. They deleted their wall furniture, so you don't have to choose our standard wall furniture. We added a couple of D-ring tie downs on the wall. That way we can strap bikes, tables, any of that stuff. Looking at the patio from the rear with the awning above. I'm just gonna turn 360 here and show you the inside from the back. So every one of our trailers come with a portable table if you want it. We've got a TV up here on the side of this pantry. So that can be viewed from the bed in up position or um, viewed from the patio even or inside the trailer down low. Um, furnace control here on the side of the pantry. We do have an adjustable shelf pantry here. So these shelves can be adjusted to any height. Some drawers below. Uh, furnace. And then of course, the 12 volt, 10 cubic foot fridge. A little bit of storage above. So like I said, a lot packed into such a small trailer. This is basically just an extension for them from the transit van that they have or the, 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 the van that will be towing this and act as another bedroom of some sort or just more living space. So I'll uh, show you this bathroom here. Our DK floor plan comes with a three by two tub or shower pan. You get to pick. Got a nice porcelain toilet here, Dometic 310. Added a grab bar here for the customer be able to hold on to and step over that lip and then of course a medicine cabinet so and then a fantastic fan here to pull that moisture out of the bathroom as quick as possible and move some air so what a beautiful trailer this is a 14 footer from this ramp door here to that bathroom wall is 10 feet you can haul a quad um, trail model side by sides dirt bikes kayaks anything you want so we build these trailers, whatever size you want. You, you can pick the desired floor plan. And yeah, wanted to show you guys this trailer because it, it, it just comes out so nice when it's done. And when it comes out exactly how you expect and how you plan for, it's that much better. So again, thanks again for watching. Appreciate every one of you. Have a great day and stay cool.